I'm there talking on the microphone with Oprah and it's like a pinnacle moment and still not fulfilled. I got the woman. Finally, I got the work. I got the prestige. And then five months into that relationship, she broke up with me. Two things happened. I was profoundly relieved and I was unfathomably devastated. Oh, thank God. I don't have to do relationship. I've been relieved of the duty of showing up for love. I can just go back to doing my own egoic things, but the deeper truth was, yeah. oh my God, everything is meaningless if I don't have someone to share this with and if I don't have a, a place to give and receive love. All of this is meaningless. I've never experienced that to that degree in my life. And I've never been suicidal, but I felt this is the psychological space within which men walk around who might kill themselves because none of this matters. Why even be here? That was a turning point for me in my life. It was a turning point for me in relationship to relationship. She and I got back together three weeks later. Our relationship didn't suddenly get easier. We still had a lot of challenges to work through, but I became relational in a way that I hadn't been relational before. I was not leaning into relation with her. So every day I lean into relationship with my wife. Mm. Yes, I have all these other things to do, but you know what? You're primary. Choose her every day or leave her. Now available as an audiobook too. A book for men and women available online everywhere.